Hello Taurus, it's Thursday the 19th of May today. So we're going to use the Sacred Traveller deck to bring in a message. Thank you angels, what do we need to know? Wow, they are actually giving me the month of October for you right now. So it feels like between now and October there's going to be huge changes. And look at this, you've got transformation. And he says a fresh new way of living emerges. So I feel that between now and October, you're going to move forward into a new area of your life. So again, you know, if you're wanting to change your job or your career or anything or do your mission full time, it feels like between now and October, this is when it's going to come in. This could also be a big sign for when your twin flame union is going to take place because you're going through a big transformation right now. And as we get into the end of your daily angel readings, I feel like this is something you need to know. So a big transformation with a new way of living is emerging now. And that's because you're surrendering to the journey. You're surrendering and you're releasing control. In other words, you're giving it to heaven saying, I'm allowing the universe to take me where it wants to take me. I'm going with the flow of my life. I'm allowing the current to take me in the right direction. You're no longer rowing in that canoe, canoe the wrong way. You know, trying to go against the current. You're putting the oars down and, ah, oh, I'm just going to go with it now. And that's bringing in everything you want. And that's also very grounding for you. It says, go deep and explore your roots. Well, you are a very powerful earth sign. And when you ground yourself, go in nature, connect with trees, walk around in the earth and the soil and the grass, you feel powerful. And you go deep and you explore your roots, remembering your power that you are a twin flame and that you are strong and that you are a light worker and that you've come here to grow. So I also feel that you may be interested in finding out more about the past, past lives, the roots of everything, the way the, the universe works. You're connecting with all things and you're finding things easier to deal with because of that. So you're less in, spending less time in ego and more time in your higher self. And yes, we do that through meditation and cleansing, but also through grounding and being in the now and living in the moment and living life and enjoying life and thriving. And that's also the energy of this day, you know, doing things because the opportunity is there to do them instead of putting things off because of finances or time or, you know, thinking I'll do it tomorrow. It's like when we have a pair of shoes, they're our best shoes and we think I'm saving them for a rainy day. Well, that day may not come. You know, you're saving that outfit for another time. Wear it now. If you want to wear it now, wear it now. The time is now. Live in the now because tomorrow we just don't know what's coming. You know, tomorrow isn't promised for any of us. We have to enjoy the now. The only one who knows how long we've got here is God and the creator and the higher power. So trust in living in the now, enjoying each moment and living fully. And there's going to be a big change around you because you're surrendering, grounding yourself, living in the now. Between now and October, there's going to move you where you're meant to be. Have a great day, sending you so much love, and I'll see you soon.